Hey guys, today I am starting a two-day, one-night adventure. I am out on the Telos Road, and I am searching for a campsite right now. There's a couple of things that I would like to do while I'm here. I'm going to go check out the ghost trains, and you're darn sure I'll be bringing you guys along. And I'm also going to just check around some of these dirt roads and scout out some more spots for another time. I've never been out in these woods and this has been a dream of mine forever and ever and ever. Um, I may come back. I do have this weekend off. It's a nice long weekend. I may come back and do this again. <clears throat> Provided I, you know, find a place and really enjoy it and like it. So hopefully we get down to, we're going to head toward its Umbazuskis, Umbazuskis <laughs> uh, campground and we're going to see if it's busy. I could have actually, I should have asked the woman at the campsite to uh, tell me if she's put anyone in there yet. I don't know if she has or not, but she suggested it. Um, she said there was Umbazuskis East and West. She said that she suggests the west side of the Umbazuskis campground or campsites. So we're going to go find out what they're like and see if I can't find them first of all. And hopefully if I can find those, we'll be able to make our way back and turn down the road that takes us to the ghost trains. Alright guys, let's start this adventure. This road is definitely not for the faint of heart. <laughs> My car is definitely being put through her paces today. Just really have to take it easy, go really slow, and just kind of watch your tire placement as best that you can. That's all you can do. I did make sure that I brought some tire plugs with me. I have also um, a can of fix a flat, and I have my spare tire. I've got some extra fuel or gas, um, so I should be all set in that aspect. But this is definitely going to be a really great time, and I may just come back here this next coming weekend um, on my next days off. We'll see. You know, it, it's it costs a little bit of money to get out here, so I may or may not. We'll we'll take that route when we get there. But I'm definitely excited to be out here right now, and I'm really glad to be able to do this. So, just incredible views, guys. So I'm about 2.7 miles down this road where I turned near the Chamberlain parking lot. And I believe I'm to go 10 miles down this road to my campsite or to where the Umbaziscus campsites are. Sorry, my car is yelling at me. Um, but also, we're going to see if we can find those trains. I'm probably going to do the trains tomorrow, but we might do them today. So, we'll see. Either way, I'm taking you guys along. I may or may not have just picked up a log <laughs> and it may or may not be sitting out the back of my car and through the front of my car too. <laughs> Probably like a six foot log. Might as well pick it up. Free firewood. The road is definitely washed out. <clears throat> I know my camera can't pick it up very well but it's definitely been washed out in many places. We need the rain. I think it's coming next week. I'm not sure, but it's not coming today or tomorrow. So I'm pretty stoked about that. And it's supposed to be in like the 70s where I'm at. So it's going to be perfect weather. Nice and breezy, little cloud cover. Mm, going to be perfect, guys. Shh. 
check this spot out, guys. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. noticing lately just the contrast of the colors in the green and how everything's just coming to life this spring and I've never really noticed the number of different colors of green there are in the leaves and the trees and the pine needles. It's really actually pretty incredible. So I'm sitting here and right in front of me is mile marker number 64. Pretty sure I just saw a big old pile of bear poop. Let's go inspect it. <laughs> if it fits, it ships, man. All right, that, my friends, looks like a big old turd. I can't quite tell what it is. Probably bear shit. Yes, probably bear shit. Mm, what a gorgeous place. Alright, let's keep going. So you can't see it well, but right now I'm about seven miles down past that ranger station, or the parking lot, and Umbazookas Lake is right beside me to my right. You can't see it because the trees are in the way, but we are almost to where the campsites are. I know where I'll be tonight. Moose. Oh my god. <laughs> it's for sale, guys. I want to buy it. <laughs> Who wants to go in halves with me? out there guys way way out there I'll point them out with my let's see to the camp say. road as his road so that's pretty cool pretty interesting slash scary but it is what it is it's really funny though he definitely poops on purpose on this road wondering if I'm going the right way if not I'm gonna have to go back and take a left the road veered off a little bit and it didn't really tell me which way to go so I'm just kind of guessing right now. <laughs> oh, little woods chicken. Ah, I totally screwed that up. My 
I wasn't looking in my camera. Oh, it's chicken. Sorry, guys. Messed that up. All right, just so you believe me. See the little black pile right in front of me? That's a bear poop. Splat. I'm pretty sure I just drove right over it. And then, right here, are two more big piles of bear poop. There's another one right up here. So he's clearly marking his territory. All right, so Bear Scat Road is just a logging road. And I just went down the road for 11 miles, and now I'm turning around. <laughs> so we're going to go back to where we saw those moose, and the road kind of wide off. We're going to go the other way. Let's see if we can get lost some more. There he is again. Let's see if I can't screw this up this time. What you doing, bud? You should probably move. No, you don't want to move. Hello, I'm gonna run you over. Do -do. <laughs> Didn't screw it up that time, guys. Alright guys, looks like this is my campsite. I think it's number 68. I could set up my tent up this way, but the ground's pretty uneven, so I'm actually just going to set it up right here in front of the picnic table. And maybe get wet. Alright, I'm going to set up camp guys. I'm going to shut the camera off, and I will see you in the next video.